Before the crack of dawn, the line stretched long. I've been really cold. My toes are aching, and uh, but I think it's worth it uh, for this Fat Tuesday. Despite the biting temperatures, the line wrapped around part of the building as customers eagerly waited to get into New Palace Bakery. It was cold. That's that's mostly what it was. Cold. <laughs> How did it feel? Very cold. We got here bright and early. Um, we were dancing to stay warm. And every now and then, you got a whiff of what you were waiting for. You can smell it as they open the door. It just smells so fresh and like home baked goodness. It's cramped. It's crowded. It's charming. Behind the counter, bakers worked nonstop to fill countless orders and make sure each pastry is perfect. We have to try them to see how they are, so we have to taste test, you know? <laughs> Must quality be a hard control. job. <laughs> quality control is the best job at a bakery, I guess. A single plume check packs more than 700 calories, but as you can see, mm, I don't really care. I got the rose hip, and hey, it's high in antioxidants, so I'm thinking um, this is healthy. <laughs> So how many punchki can you put away? Probably three to four. Three to four? Yes. yes. That's about 2,100 calories. It's no problem. On punchki day, no problem. Polish Catholics began making punchki to rid their cabinets of large sugar, fruit, and eggs before the 40 days of Lent. So what are they giving up for this fasting period? Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> I haven't thought that far ahead yet. No, we no. have. Guess we'll worry about that after the punchki coma wears off. From Hamtramck, Smitha Koloki, 7 Action News.